What might this be? General lies between the constellations of Taurus and Cancer as one of, the, one of the constellations of the Zodiac. The constellation contains 85 stars visible to the naked eye and is identifiable by its two brightest stars, Castor and Pollux. So those are the heads at the very top there. Uh, Castor and Pollux. Hold the phone. That's those are the names that we use to open the cases. If the heroes, oh, sorry, very tired uh, of Greek mythology. Greek mythology generally associated with the twins Castor and Pollux, two brothers together known as the Dioxori. I butchered that. They are commonly associated with horses and are often depicted in art and literature as helmed horsemen armed with spears. Their mother was Leda, while Castor was the mortal son of uh, Tyder, Ty, Tyderis, and the king of Sparta. Pollux begged his father to grant Castor immortality, and thus the twins were united in the heavens. The Geminids, uh, one of the richest meteor showers of the year, upwards of 100 meteors per hour. Wow! God, that's a lot. Uh, the Geminids peak on December 13th and 14th. Hmm. The Medusa Nebula two two seven four. I will continue back here for a little bit, hoping to stumble across something I can use this on. I'll lose it now, won't I? Yeah. I only have this now. Hello. Oh. I just need to go back and check the uh, the bit up there to see if ah uh, okay so I need to find all six of them they'll probably be scattered around.
Huh. Ah. Got something in Orion's belt. We just need to find another two. Oh, that'll be fun. While recording, I discovered these textured panels on the roof, similar to the ones we saw in the book earlier. I also discovered another set in the uh, storage room on the on the lower floor. figurines uh -huh. hello found you One left. Oh, we're still going down there. Ooh, a painting. That is a ooh, black hole, maybe. Who knows? Turn you off. There we go. Ah, one of the action figures. I continued to explore for about another half hour or so before I finally found this, the small sun. After that, I immediately went to add it to Orion's belt, just next to the nebula there. I continued to search for about another half hour before I eventually just gave up. It was only now in editing that I realized the sun I was looking for was upstairs. So we're going to figure out how to get that next time, and as always, good night, mortals. <laughs>